one final task, not to completely re-traumatize you, okay. but we do have an honesty box question okay. for you. Hit me with it. Oh god, <laughs> we can't let you go without doing something. I'm assuming something. these are like pre-put in. Not at all. Strategically chosen exactly what these are going to be. Please get Cute out your box, phone and show Loving us. the glitter. <laughs> what do you think was the biggest factor that led to your breakup with Ollie, and what are you looking for in your next relationship? The biggest factor. Um. It's a hard one to answer. I just feel like we potentially clashed on a lot of things outside of the experiment um, and the stuff that we perhaps thought were on the same page during that time in the real world discovered that we weren't. Um, And that unfortunately doesn't work out in a real world situation. I think when you're in the experiment and you're kind of, you know, going about your day with no control and you know you don't have your job you're just doing what the producers say it's very different than you know having a job having a house all of that stuff so I feel like yeah clashing in those certain areas and like lifestyle things um and the other part was it and what are you looking for in your next relationship honestly I don't know yet I feel like um it's so hard because I'm like I want to date but then I'm like, no, I don't. I feel like it's even going to be worse because obviously me going into maths, I already was having such a bad time with the online dating space and I hated it and don't really want to be doing that again. So now I'm like, what do I do? (laughs) Um, So I think I just want someone that is, yeah, just all about me. Um, Someone that accepts me, what I do, um, my career, what I want out of life and just kind of is supportive of that. And just someone that champions me and someone that's going to be by my side through this crazy ride called life. Would you want them to also be in the public eye? Um, I've been thinking about this. I'm not opposed to someone in the public eye, but also it would I would probably want someone that maybe isn't. Um, but also I think it's hard when if they're not and they don't understand what you mm. do and then they're a bit like they don't really get it. I feel like someone would really have to kind of get it and not really judge. I think that's a hard thing because a lot of people that aren't in the space, they're kind of like... Yeah, they don't really understand they understand what it's like. So yeah. I think, yeah, it really depends because I feel like sometimes I just want like a normie person that's just like doesn't care about any of it. But then sometimes it probably is easier to meet someone that gets it and is already in the space and you don't have to explain everything a million times. Yeah. <laughs> maybe he's listening to this podcast. Maybe, maybe. <laughs> Me and you dating up. <laughs> you dating Slide up in the DMs. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> 